Hey everyone, we're Two Crafty Sheilas. I'm Belle and I've got Loz on the line with me and today we're going to do another unboxing. Today we're going to do Diamond Art Club Undersea Treasure by Adrian Chesterman. It's a beautiful image. It's lovely. It's a big one too. Um, so this one I did get as yet another one of those Black Friday sales. I've almost finished. We've just got two more <laughs> after this one, I promise. Um, but I did just check before. This one is actually still in stock with Diamond Art Club. So if you do like this, you can always go and check it out for yourself. All right. So working around the box, we've got our picture, as you saw. This one is a square and it's a 98 by 70 centimetre. So a bit of a Whoa. big whopper. Yes. Yeah. And I think it's going to a lot of confetti so I should be happy we'll see how we go <laughs> <laughs> <Love it. laughs> so we have the square to say that they are square diamonds which also has written on their square diamonds so nice little trick for us um it's got the blue strip across the top to tell us that it is also squares and you've got that blue background of the um, generic image that they've got all right on the side Again, nice square bit here. We've got their logo, Diamond Art Club, Do What Makes You Sparkle. The back, all the tips and tricks about how to diamond paint. And we've got a QR code that you can scan to get 10% off. All right, let's open it up. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was a really big box. Okay. That's uh, pretty chockers. I think there's going to be a few out. things. How come the stickers Sorry? out there? The stickers. No, yeah, the other one. These ones. Yeah. Two pages. Aren't they usually wrapped up in the side? Yeah, I, I pulled it out just to have a look and make sure oh. that it was all okay. So I just had it on the outside of the box. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. It's all right. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Take a breath. We're good. Calm, calm, calm down. <laughs> That's right. That's right. All right. Since Loz raised it, we'll start with the sticker sheet. <laughs> so Sorry. this is a sticker, a sticker sheet that you can keep uh, for your logbook. Um, so in there, it's got all your information. So the name of the kit, it's who it's by, your start and your end date. Lovely image of so what we're going to be doing. Uh, square 98 by 70 centimeter and their skew number so these are all individually cut stickers so you can use these to help you kit up there are 80 colors whoa <laughs> i'll say that again 80 colors <laughs> <sighs> okay yeah it's it's a chockers one um <laughs> okay so <laughs> diamond art club anything that's under 150 is one of their aa drills aurora australis drills we will show you what they look like soon um this one has five and they've got three of the fairy dust because they're Z drills um and i can also see there's one two three four of the six thousand so the six thousands are standard colors but they're a diamond art club blend so it's their own sort of numbering in the system there so interesting okay you also get just a little sticker um, that also has all the information on it some people put this on the end of their box depending on how they store the box um, I generally just put it in my logbook as well just as a little image toolkit let's have a look and see what we get in there the diamond art club toolkit usually has everything you need plus a couple of little extras so let's have a look. all right and i see i love that this is reusable and recyclable okay <laughs> sorry <laughs> world uh you know world environment promo right there um <laughs> this is washi tape so it's a really cute little image. Oh, I like that uh, one. Like, yeah, a little floral scene. It's quite nice. Um, so washi tape is a bonus. You really don't need this to be able to diamond paint, but it is nice. Um, sometimes the glue on the diamond kits can go a little bit past the edge of it. So you can use something like your washi tape just to line the outside so that you don't get dust and debris in the section that we're not actually diamond painting. Um, we can also use this to section off our canvas. And I do have a video that we've already created about sectioning off your canvas using washi tape. I'll put a link of that in the description if you need. All right, you get... 
a standard little glitter pen with a squishy. Let's see how we go. Oh, super easy. <laughs> no that just way. Slid on so much. Yeah. Yeah. Look at how easy that was. Woo, straight on. <laughs> how excited no, I got the there. Screen. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Street today, woo! We're winning. <laughs> oh, um, so. We need more coffee. <laughs> yeah. Yes, we do. <laughs> You've got your standard oh, little yeah. single brass placer, single placer, and you also get a little four tip and a seven tip for a multi placers. These are the nice thin ones, so you can just pop that in the end of your pen like so, and then you can diamond paint. All right, we've got branded tweezers, which you only get in the square kits for Diamond Art Club. Um, oh, yes, these ones are sharper than I've had for a little while. So please make sure that you keep the cover on this one so that you don't stab yourself, unlike Laws and apparently her husband. <laughs> Watch some of our previous videos to understand what yep. all this is about. <laughs> Have a good laugh. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> we get two little uh, heart waxes. Um, now, on the side of the wax, there's a plastic cover on both the front and the back. So please make sure that you remove that before you try and fill your pen. Um, but a nice little caddy for them to go in as well. We get our baggie of bags. Not too many in there. They're certainly not 80. So... <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Um, we've got a tray, a standard tray with a little stopper in it. Now, I have mentioned in videos previously, apparently this is the way that it is supposed to go with the stopper up um, and on the outside so that some people will put like a little sticker on there if they've got plenty of trays to say what number, colour they've got in there. I personally, and I think you do two laws, we pop yeah. it in this way. Um, it just feels a little bit more secure. But honestly, it doesn't really matter. Whatever works for you. And then the other little nicety, which you don't need, but it is nice to have, is a little cover minder. So a cute little teddy bear. Um, now with a cover minder, you get two magnets, so one on the back and then an extra one there. If you happen to open one and the magnets are stuck together and they're not attached to the cover minder for some reason, a little bit of craft glue, it's really not that hard to do for yourself. Um, but all you do with this one is you would peel back the plastic of your diamond kit um, for the section that you want to work on, you take the magnet off the back of this, put it underneath your diamond painting, and then stick this down to hold your plastic back. Alrighty, I'm just going to quickly pop this away. Okay. All right, let's get this big boy out. Oh, so we have branded dust cover bag, Diamond Art Club, do what makes you sparkle. All right. And you can see it's jammed in there pretty tight. Oh, <laughs> Okay. <laughs> oh, it goes this way. All right. Now you can see that it is a little bit squashed down this end. It's fine. This is a self-flattening canvas. There's no major creases in there. It's just a little squash, so I'm not worried. But we will have a better look as we open it up. Oh. Look at these colours. Holy. Beautiful. Beautiful. There's a detail um, in it. Just gorgeous. Now, obviously, this is not all going to fit in the camera view. Apologies. <laughs> so I will move it around a little bit so that you can see. Um, and as I was pointed out, this would be where we would normally get the, the um, hitting up <laughs> stickers. I've just taken it out because I was checking everything before I did it. <laughs> Alrighty, so hopefully this will flatten down in a moment. If not, I can roll it back because it is poured glue. But let's have a look at this in the short term. So we've got a little thank you for your purchase leaflet. Um, it's what's included in your kits in three of the probably main languages of the world. Um, you can do a QR code to have a look at a video for step-by-step -step instructions, a QR code for the Facebook group, more detailed step-by-step -step instructions there, tips and tricks with a code that you can use to get a discount and then QR codes for the Diamond Art Club app for both iPhone and Android and you can get a discount on your first purchase. All right, check out that mother. <laughs> <laughs> so the drills, they could do come in a bag and it is um, 
labeled with the name of the kit. So if you do want to keep your drills separate to your canvas, you will easily be able to match them up again. Oh my gosh, that is so big. All right, let's have a very quick look around the canvas. I'm just going to roll it back off, cam off um, camera though, just to help it flatten a little bit faster. It's just going to take a hot minute because it is so big. <laughs> <laughs> is that the biggest canvas you've done will it be or have you done... uh it's the same size as the one i've done yeah i thought it might yeah i thought it was would have been close so you've done a bigger one i've done i've done another 98 by 70 i'm also currently doing a 98 by 70 um yeah. i've done a couple that was slightly longer i think i've done about 105 long but i don't think it was yeah. quite this wide i think it was only about 60 wide so yeah fairly similar all right so you can see that's flattened pretty quickly pretty easily so let's have a quick look around the canvas as i move it around the camera all right up the top diamond art club do what makes you sparkle on the left side there is a legend with all 80 colors listed Holy. down the <laughs> so big down the bottom here is a little thumbnail of the image and the information about it so it is undersea treasure 98 by 70 it is copyrighted between adrian chesterman through mgl art oh that was the box sorry and it's also obviously licensed with diamond art club all right over here we've got information about all the socials as well as that code again to get a discount we've got our lifetime guarantee on this side so if anything does go wrong with the canvas and or drills and you are the original purchaser you can contact diamond art club to access that warranty and we have another legend on the side which i think you're probably going to need with a 98 by 70. okay <laughs> i'm gonna oh, look at that that treasure that it is just looks beautiful. so detailed, isn't it? It's. I was just oh, yeah. looking at the clownfish, and it's like they just looked perfect, even though yeah. you're up close. It just looked amazing. Yeah, no, wow. that's so lovely, beautiful, and even like you've got the um, oh, what are they? The spiky the lionfish. Lionfish. Yes. Lovely. That looks amazing. I almost feel like this is going to be just off our backyard in the great barrier yep. reef yep i agree you'd see Love all it. that out here yep heck yes not at the same yes. time but yeah <laughs> <laughs> looks even like um your spiky starfish the only thing i keep thinking is like crown of thorns but it's too bright for that and we don't want crown of thorns because they bright. tend to yeah, we don't need kill off the coral so let's <laughs> not let it be a crown of thorns <laughs> yeah. and i love the little um crab that is so, so cool. <laughs> so cute. I love it. All right, I'm going to flip it over so we can have a look at the drills and look at the big mother and then struggle straight we'll to put it all back away. Yes, <laughs> you need to do it too. No, nope. I've done it once. One. <laughs> I've done it once. I'm not doing it again. <laughs> uh -huh. All right. Oh, that's a nice little one. Let's start with that. Why not? All right, so oh, look at that blue. Love it. Lovely. Okay, one train down. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we've got two bags of 310. All right, let's just, at least it doesn't look too staticky. That, that actually looks pretty good. Mm. Um, they feel really nice. It doesn't feel staticky. And having a look at the bottoms, they look pretty good. I'm seeing a tiny bit of trash there, but look, it's not it's not uncommon. That looks pretty good. I think they'll be nice to work with. Okay. Oh, look at that. That fuchsia oh, colour. That is beautiful. It is a fuchsia. It's sort of looking a little bit probably plummy. Maybe more red. Yeah. But it's definitely more fuchsia. That is gorgeous. Oh yeah, I've got that. oh yeah, two of the three oh three oh ones, and here's our first AA. Oh, look at that one! Beautiful. So one ten. So as I mentioned before, Diamond Art Club, anything under one fifty is an AA drill, and an Aurora Australis. Um, <laughs> unlike the Northern Hemisphere people who call it Aurora Borealis. 
Um, but as you can see, there's a coating on it that sort of makes it more like a rainbow effect. Um, they're really, really bright and shimmery and they'll pick up some of the colours of the drills around them, really help to enhance that section of the, the painting. Beautiful. And it's a nice is that like bag. a red color? I like that. It is, is. It more of an orange. Oh. Yeah, it's it's more red in real life than it's showing up on the camera. It's almost got like a slight pink tinge to it. It's yeah. beautiful, lovely, beautiful. Oh, look at that blue! I love that. Oh, two bags of that one. That's got to be in the sea, surely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at these colours. 3766, nice. Oh, there's our 3843. Oh, so beautiful. Again, more of that fuchsia sort of a tone. Really bright colouring. I love it. Oh, and two bags of 807. Lovely. Did I say 807? You yep. did. Three bags of 807. <laughs> <laughs> and another AA, one for one. Diamond Art Club oh. special. Two oh, bags of one for one. That is going to glow. Oh, lovely. Love it. All right. Browns. We've got a few browns through here. Oh, two bags of 3842. Really dark blue. That's nice. Oh, another AA, 138. Oh. Pretty. I like that. Oh, two bags. Oh. <laughs> Added bonus. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Oh, another AA, 133. Oh, that one's pretty too. That is a really bright orange. That's nice. Oh, very industrial. Goodness me, I'm finding them all at the moment. Okay. <laughs> Oops, sorry for knocking the camera. All right, so Z means that it's a fairy dust. Um, now, this one, you might be able to see really, really shimmer, a really fine shimmer just on the top of the drills there. Um, it's got like a fine layer of glitter or mica powder or something, just a really subtle shine to it. They're really nice. You can see a little bit reflecting there. But beautiful, beautiful colouring. All right. Oh, there's two bags of 3371, so it is a little bit darker. Mm. <gasps> Look at that blue. 995. Two bags. Mm. Yeah, 45. Nice. These are lovely blues. I really like these. Oh, we've got another small train of these ones. We're going to go back the other way this time. <laughs> Nothing like mixing it up, hey? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so one bag of 798, but two bags of 797. Just that subtle change. And two bags of 826. That's a pretty blue. Okay. All right. And we'll go back the other way. All right. So this one, there might have been other 6,000s in there, um, but this one is one of those special ones that we were talking about. It's a standard drill, um, but... This is one that Diamond Art Club has created. So 6,011. Really pretty. That's beautiful. Mm. Bright orange for you, Loz. Yeah. For my purple fans, 208. I'm going to get more of the greens in this one. It's a really dark maroon. Like that's more of like your plummy colour. Yeah, it looks quite plumbing through this way, through the camera. Nice. Oh, there's the 6,000, so another one of the Diamond Art Club numbers. Did I miss some of the other specials? I had a few ABs. Like How many were you meant to have? I was meant to have five ABs and three fairy dust. You only have one fair fairy dust. I mean, That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Oh, this is very oh, much God. a Bell special, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we did one for one. So there's one there. 
We did one, three, eight, two, one, three, three, three. We did. There was that Z that we did with it. So I've had one and three. Okay. Oh, I missed a train. Okay. Oh, <laughs> the little ones. <laughs> Let's get those out of the way so we don't confuse it again. Okay. Much better. Righto. Apologies, people. <laughs> All right. It's a fairy dust drill to start us off. That is a really pretty color. Oh, oh I love that. That, that is gorgeous. Is so nice. And really subtle. Like it's hard to even sort of see the the coating yeah. on the top of it. That is really subtle. I like that. These are our paler colours. And there's our third fairy dust. So that covers our fairy dust now. <laughs> Look at that. Price is That's averted normal. there. Yeah. <laughs> how when there's 80 colors I, you don't know when <laughs> you've covered them all that's all right <laughs> i'll let you off the hook there hey oh thank you <laughs> you're so generous i'm very caring today <laughs> <laughs> and there's another a b oh, i haven't seen this one 122 oh wow a a i haven't seen that either that is pretty i like that one <laughs> That's a pretty color. Mm. And we're getting down. There we go. Right. Oh, that's going to be fun to try and put them away. Oh, road <laughs> drill. Oh, another you road drill. Just throw them in the throw them in a bag. <laughs> well, it was pretty no shockers in that bag. It's going to be skill to put them back in. <laughs> <laughs> Just get a brown woolies bag. You'll be right. <laughs> <laughs> Might have to. Probably do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So let's have a look and see where all our specials are. I will try to do this fairly quickly because there's a few. All right. First one is 110, which was that red that had the tiny little bit of like pink through it. So it's the symbol mm. one. Let's see if we can find it. This could take a while. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Sorry, it's part of this coral. So it's sort of that edging around the, oh, the coral lovely. bit. Oh, lovely. That bird's Three. back. Here? Sorry. Or with you? No. At your with house? Oh, yeah. Provided it's okay. <laughs> provided it doesn't run into the window again. Yeah, no. I think he's all right. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Maybe a bit stunned. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then I don't know whether this is, I think this is another bit of like coral. Let's have a look. Anemone? Yeah, an actually, an it is an anemone. Anemone, 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 anemone. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, it is an anemone. Um, and it's got three ones through here. So, yeah, that's like they're all just like sort of patches. Oh, lovely. That's going to be pretty. Um, oh, tiny, tiny little bit over here with this bit of coral. Oh, okay. This bigger anemone section, there is lines of it just up through here. Oh, you can see it. That looks lovely. Beautiful. Um, is there any? Oh, my gosh. Sorry. This is such a big canvas. Oh, okay. The last section that I can see. Let's just bring it up this way. Our clownfish. Oh, All of the you. red is actually going to be those ABs, probably because it's so close to the surface of the water. Yeah. That'll give them more of a glow. Oh, pretty. <laughs> <That's> great. <laughs> and there's a little bit in the, I think that's a parrotfish. Yeah. Maybe. Um, there's a little Looks bit like through that. there. And a little bit in our lionfish. Oh, so that'd be nice. All right, the next one is one, two, two, which was the greeny, that really nice green that we hadn't really seen before. Um, so again, a little bit through here, through here. I don't know. Is, is that like is that? seaweed or is it? Is 
sunrays? Maybe seaweed? Yeah, sorry. This is the original image. So it's sort of up through here. So, yeah, maybe a bit of seaweed. Yeah, right. I'm wondering if that's like a shipwreck down here. I was, yeah, I was just thinking that. Is that like the mast of a shipwreck? Hmm. That'll be interesting to see when it comes together. Might yes. Stand out a bit more. Yes, hopefully. Um, but it looks like, you know, big sections of it, you know, oh, sort wow. of lining up through there. So that'll be nice. Um, is there any anywhere else? I'm assuming there'll be some down here. Yeah, just a small section of it up here near the clownfish. Up there. Hmm. Only that tiny bit in that section. Maybe because it's too far down underwater. Yeah. A <laughs> um, little bit of a section through here. A little bit at the top there. All right. Oh, my gosh. The canvas is so big. Okay. Sorry, I keep saying that. Tiny little bit of it here next to the the crab. There and a little bit over here as well. I'm jealous. I can hear you diamond arting. <laughs> I'm trying to be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just calling I'm you out on it. Sorry, Loz. <laughs> I'm, I am. I, I am. <laughs> um, there's just a tiny bit again, like four. Four beads down the bottom here. But it was a full packet, wasn't it? Or was that one of the smaller ones? That one was a reasonable one. I'm assuming it's probably because there's more at the top. On the top, yeah. yeah right. And see, like, again, just a tiny little bit in the fish's tail there. I love those fish. Tiny little bit. <laughs> is that a puffer fish? No, what is that? I can't see. Oh, that's a necklace. That's I was a necklace. Say, it's, not, it's not a fish, yeah. Mm. Tiny little bits just associated with that. There's not many there, though. Yeah, I think it's mainly going to be up at the top over there, I think. Yeah. Um, okay, next, the 133, which was more of that brighter red, that's going to be basically where you see the bright red. So the clownfish down here has some, a um, little bit through here where the clownfish is poking out, and in this clownfish, just little patches of it to give it a bit of highlighting. Um, a little bit on the, is that the coral? I think that's a coral mm. next to it. Um, a bit through there and on this section. Oh, a little bit of it on the anemone here, but it's mainly going to be the ones. Actually, the ones and threes are going to be butting up against each other. That's going to glow. Oh, that's going to be beautiful. And lots more of the threes down here. Like the, the lines that you can see of the red, they're all going to be threes. Um, the fish, whatever fish that is, there's big sections of it, big lines of it through there. So that'll be pretty. Um, no, not through there. Oh, patches of it, like lines butting up against some of those darker colours are all threes. They're going to be pretty. Tiny little bit in the crab and down on the claws. The crown of thorns, it's not really a crown of thorns as far as we're concerned. There's little no. bits of it on there. <laughs> um, little bits of it through this bit of coral. Again, just like lines of it. Um, just highlighting sort of where the, the light's obviously hitting it from the top. And a little bit on the, oh, what are those? Are they like sea slugs? This bit here. Is it, It's not a cucumber, is it? I don't know. It's got like the wavy bit at the bottom, like the, I don't know what they're called. No, like the flipper know. thingy me bobby goes all around the bottom. So I wonder if they're a sea slug. <laughs> flipper thingy me bob. <laughs> <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> okay. Sea oh, slug slash sea cucumber. <laughs> <laughs> with flippers. <laughs> Yeah, let's go with that. Oh. But it's it's like the whole like the skirt one. Oh, I like see it's got, what you like, mean now. I couldn't see it before. They can't. They're like the Spanish dancers, aren't they? And they kind oh, of maybe. just flapping them. 
flap in the breeze. You mean like flamenco? Right is that what you mean? Yeah. <laughs> no, but they're like, I'm, I know what you mean. I don't know what they're called. But okay. yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's why I was wondering if it's like a sea sponge. Oh, no, a sea sponge. Oh, my gosh. Now I'm saying the wrong thing. A sea slug. <laughs> no, but they don't. They sort of go with the flow. Don't they? They can swim. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yes. Because the flipper tail dress <laughs> curtain thing me bobby dibby wackery thing like it sort of like can shimmer and move it around and help it yeah. to sort of like swim yeah. and move along mm. i can picture it but yeah i don't i don't know <laughs> <laughs> if you know what it is anyone listening yeah, tell like, us in the comments what, below because we are flailing like right now <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh okay <laughs> So, yeah, there's there's a line of it through whatever animal this thing is. Um, there's that there. It's a little bit through, again, lines of it on this um, coral. The clownfish, like a big section of it here and here. This I can actually see. I can show you. There's a lot of, like, sections, but there is a lot of different colours. You can see all the different symbols yeah. on there. Wow. Um, so there will be a lot of definition through there. Um, now, it's not going to be on the clownfish at the top because we knew they are all ones. But a little bit on the parrotfish, there's above, like the ones were down here, the threes are going to be up a little bit higher. So that will be nice. Um, and a tiny little bit lower down on the lionfish. So, again, I think that – lighter pinky red is going to be more at the mm. top um, whereas your darker ones down the bottom but that's gonna be nice so. all right the number four is 138 which was that beautiful blue now there were a couple of bags of this oh yeah so let's see oh it's got to be up the top more so than anywhere else oh there's a little bit down on this fish there's a little bit through there oh it's so bright isn't it oh gorgeous a little bit around the tail of this fish um, and a little bit around here of the coral down there. Okay. Tiny little bit through here with the treasure um, and just, look, it's dotted um, all throughout this bit of coral. Yes, oh. blue coral. This fish down here, all the blue that you can see on that fish, that's all fours. That's going to stand out because all you can see sort of on that fish is the blue. Yeah, it takes exactly. To sort of see the yellow. Yeah. No, that's going to be lovely. Um, here, just a tiny bit around that section, a tiny little bit around here. There's really not much of it down the bottom. I'm expecting most of this to be at the top. Okay. Let's have a proper look. Oh, so this parrotfish there's a whole chunk of it that's going to be through there um, and sections of it on the side of this coral or anemone it's going to be there look lines of it all through here like there's patches of it there most of that lighter coloring so the more of the blue that is all four. Oh wow yeah that's beautiful so huge um, and it's just all the way across the top, you know, like there's lines of it through here. There's sections of it up through here. Um, more of it coming all the way along here. Like there's just huge, huge sections of it um, all through here, all across here with all the lines. Let's move you further along. Again, up the top here, just patches of it. There is oh, so many lovely. fours. This is just going to shine. That would be amazing. Wow. wow. Um, the fifth AA is 141. So that's, as always, for Diamond R Club, that's the white background with the black dot. So clownfish, all the white sections of the clownfish, um, they're all going to be that 141. Um Basically, anywhere where you're seeing the white is where it's going to be. So this um, piece of jewellery, I don't know whether it's, I think it's a bracelet, um, but the top of that 
is going to be your 141. Um, your wider sections of this coral, 141. The tops of your tubes of these corals, they're all 141 along the side of it, through this fish, up on these. Um, what are they? Angelfish. They've all got the 141. All your bubbles at the top. Let me show you the bubbles. Okay, so all the bubbles are oh, one for one. Blow yeah. holes on the dolphins, one for one, with a little bit of shine at the top, more bubbles. The edging around this dolphin's um, muzzle, whatever they call mouth, nose, nose, um, along the top, that whole, oh, my gosh, this whole section, one for one. Oh, wow. And bubbles here. Um, the top of the chest, they're all one for one and around the edge. All the locks, they're all going to be one for one. And that edging around, I'm going to just call it the treasure. There's all sorts. There's going to be like this looks to me like it's um, like a pearl necklace. So mm. all of that edging, one for That's one. Purple, yeah. All that edging, one for one. Around the chalice, you know, where you're seeing the white, one for one. The skirty, dancy, doobie whackery thingamy bob on that <laughs> sweet cucumber slash sea slug slash whatever it actually is. That's all one for one. Yeah. <laughs> We've got to laugh at it. Like, I've got nothing else. To. Yeah. <laughs> um, sections of, I don't even know what that is. It's actually quite like this thing. I don't know what this thing is. Maybe What's just that? a jewel? A jewel, I think. Is it a ring? Looks like a diamond ring. Looks like a big diamond on it. I don't know. Maybe. Oh no, um, I see whatever it that is. Like a, yeah, that's a big that's a big diamond. I think it is. Yeah, um so obviously like where that's big. glistening. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so where it's glistening and shining, that's all got it. Um, this sea anemone. No, I don't think that's an anemone. I don't know what that is. Something else that lives on the reef. Gee, we're really good central Queenslanders, aren't we? <laughs> oh, we are. <laughs> <laughs> and more on the clown. There's all your whites. There is tons. That's going to be so nice. All right. That was all our AAs. So now we can have a look at our fairy dust. Okay. So that really pretty purple z554 is i think it's the forward slash which everyone goes that way is that forward slash yep. i don't know <laughs> yeah let's okay. go with that <laughs> you know I mean? oh yep. okay sorry i don't think there was heaps of it so there's just a little section of your really light purple through here oh yeah that's where it's going to be so quite subtle but it is it's in places where there's no AA. Oh, so the so shine it's just on just about the yeah, yeah. I have to give us a little highlight. Nice. Yes. There is a little bit through this doobie wackery seagrass sea thing that we don't know what it is. Um, there is a bit through there. So I think that one will shine because that's butting up against the 141. So that'll be interesting. Oh, nice. And a little bit through yeah. skirty thing of me, Bob, that I'm not going through again, that thing. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just call it, well, I was going to say Karen. <laughs> Should we call it the flamenco dancer? You, you like the flamenco. Let's just call it the flamenco dancer. Yeah, that, that'll do. The yeah. Spanish thing. <laughs> oh, we're good at this. Okay. It's um, in this little bit of coral, it's butting up against the 141. So, again, I think that's really just going to shine. That's going to be nice. Um. Oh, my gosh. Sorry, knock something off the table. Don't worry about it. It's not breakable. We're, We're good. good. <laughs> um, up through here, we've just got little lines of it, little patches. But, again, it's not near any AB, AA. Um, so that one's just going to be really subtle on its own. I like that. Oh, like yeah, that. that's nice. Hmm. Um, oh, and a tiny little bit. All right, up through. Oh, where am I? Down here. A little bit up through this dolphin. Oh, it's wow. just up near yeah. the blowhole. So that'll be really subtle because, again, it's going to be near the white AB. Yeah. 
AA. Oh, we'll get it right one day. <laughs> You're struggling as bad as I was. <laughs> I am. Oh, and it's on the other side of the other dolphin. But did you see I just glazed over that one, Loz? <laughs> yeah, I saw that. <laughs> and it's up on the top of the two of the treasure chest. I was gonna say tool chest. Oh my goodness. <laughs> treasure it chest. Be. It's up on the top of here. Someone's tools. <laughs> true, true. Once you've emptied out all the treasure and you spent it all, you can fill it with tools. That's, That's funny. funny. <laughs> Yep. Oh, <laughs> uh, and little lines of it up through this bit of coral as well. So it just looks really subtle. That's quite good. That's nice um, because you want the AAs yeah. to kind of stand out more, don't you? It's exactly. In this, this, this is just one that particular. subtle shimmer. Yeah, no, yeah. really good. Uh, Z747 was that lighter blue green. Um, and it's, I'm going to call it like, I don't know what symbol this is. The magic wand. Matchstick? Matchstick? Let's is go with matchstick. Match yeah. Yeah. That works. That's good. Yeah, that'll do. <laughs> <laughs> we roll with anything today. It's yeah. all good. Yeah. All right. Um, again, just little lines of it. I don't think there was tons of this one either. So really sort of subtle patches through there, through the, what are these? Angelfish. Yep. Um, and again, back through there. So it looks like on all the angelfish it's got it. Um, oh, it's actually going to be, okay, let me let me just fold over the canvas a little bit. Okay. It's also, so wherever the white AB is up here, there was those sections of like a little bit of blue that were coming through it. There, oh, that fairy dust. That is cool. Yeah. I like how so they've done that. Really wide. So that's beautiful oh no oh, okay that is lovely um and a little bit higher up it kind of makes sense it's it's nearer to the surface so i get that yeah all right yeah and again just tiny little bits of it up on like the parrot fish a little bit around this fish here that looks like probably about it I might have missed a few. Sorry, guys. Um, <laughs> it, it's a big, busy image. I'm oh. sorry. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> and the last one is Z959, which was the darker blue-green. And it's like your little um, up triangle thing. Well, it's not a triangle, but it's like your arrow part of the triangle, that one. <laughs> yep. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah, that thing. <laughs> <laughs> Epic fail today. Okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, a little bit of it, the, the darker bits through this bit of coral. Um, so you can sort of see lines of it up through the lines of it up the top here. That will be really nice. Again, just really subtle. Um, and same with over this side, through this bit of coral through here. The more of like your, your blue-green colour, that's all going to be fairy dust. Oh, lovely. Nice. Um, oh my gosh. Okay. Tiny little bits of it around the that necklace. Um, and the bottom of the tail of this fish is gonna have it in there. Um, the underside of our dolphin, there's lines of it sort of outlining the dolphin there. So that'll be oh sorry. You won't even in view. Um, lines of it underneath the dolphin. So that's going to be really pretty. If parts on that fish. Stop laughing at me, Loz. <laughs> cool little sections of it up here. Um, I think that might be about it. Oh, section of it up the top. Oh, underneath the stingray. Oh, lovely. That's cool. That's cool. And a section of it. Oh, I think I did that one as a start. But that looks like it's about it. I think that's pretty busy. I think that's going to be really, really pretty. It will be. That It really will be. I've got to finish just looking at that treasure chest. That oh. is beautiful. But it's Absolutely rendered amazing, isn't it? It's just yes. so much detail. 
Yeah, that's it. I love like you can tell the straps and they've even got like the black holes in there yeah. for like, you know, where you would do like a belt up sort of a thing, like your belt holes or whatever they're called. Um, mm. Beautiful, beautiful. You know, you can see that there's a lock down here. Oh, that's I amazing. love it. Mm. You need Sorry, I'll stop that. <laughs> yes, yes, it had to be this size to get this level of detail. Yeah. Could you imagine if well, they did it any smaller, like that coral oh, would just look ridiculous. It'd just blur, wouldn't it? It'd just be all a big blur. Yeah. Yeah, this is gorgeous. Okay, enough gushing. Um, so <laughs> let's close this off. Oh, my gosh, this is a long recording. Okay, um, so this one is Undersea Treasure by Adrian Chesterman and Diamond Art Club. It is a 98 by 70 square drill with 80 colours three of which are fairy dust and five are AAs. Um, let me know down in the comments, what do you think of this one? Do you like it? Do you want it? Do you have it? Have you done it? Tell us all the things. Um, I did see it is still in stock with Diamond Art Club at time of recording. So I will put a link of it in the description below. Um, but if you like this video and the chaos that we bring, um, give us a thumbs up. <laughs> definitely does help us for the YouTube stuff. Uh, and if you do like what we're doing, please subscribe and follow us along on our crazy, crazy journey. But other than that, I hope you all have a good week and we'll see you in another video soon. Thanks. Bye. Bye.